We are here to represent the hundreds of kids who have been diagnosed with pediatric brain tumors. <coughs> Treatment for pediatric brain tumors can include surgery, chemo, and radiation. Along with treatment, there are hundreds of clinic visits, needle pokes, MRIs, CT scans, and visits to other specialists to deal with the effects of treatment. So thank you, Sean and Nir, for devoting your time and energy to ride across Canada for Megan's Walk and for raising much needed funds and awareness for pediatric brain tumor research. When I was in 2006, when I was six, I was diagnosed with a brainstem astrocytoma after experiencing nausea, vomiting, and balance issues. My neurosurgeon at SickKids, Dr. Kokarni, removed most of the tumor, but a small portion remained on the brainstem. Over the years, my tumor has grown slowly and in January I began 70 weeks of chemotherapy. And in 2002 when I was two and a half I was diagnosed with an anaplastic copanoloma. I had surgery, chemo, and radiation. When I was five and a half the tumor grew significantly and I had another major surgery followed by a year and a half of chemo. When I was nine and a half, the tumor grew significantly, significantly again, and cancer cells were in my cerebral spinal fluid down my spine. Surgery, surgery was followed by full brain and radiation treatments. One thing that Tobin and I have in common is our participation in Megan's Walk. I have participated in Megan's Walk since I was seven years old. I remember looking out the hospital windows when I was six. It was so amazing to see thousands of people form a hug around sick kids. I was determined to be a part of the hug the following year and I achieved that goal. I have participated in Megan's Walk for 15 years since I was three. I was quite little for the first few. And Sean and Nir, it's great to have you taking the message of hope across Canada for kids with, for kids with pediatric brain tumors. We hope along with you that the impact of ongoing and promising research will grow through Bike for Kids 2017. Donations to Megan's Walk will go directly to brain tumor research projects in the Quinlan and have impacted brain tumor research in three primary ways. The first way, Megan's Walk Neuro-Oncology Neuro Fellowship, which furthers clinical research training in subspecialties of pediatric oncology. The second way, equipment. Megan's Walk allows for capital research equipment purchases and equipment upgrades. In 2016, Megan's Walk funding purchased $73,000 of equipment. And now, number three, the majority of funds that Megan's Walk received go to novel seed projects in the labs of the Brain Tumor Research Center at Sickens. Through the National Collaborative Seed Grant Competition, which was initiated by Megan's Walk. Four awards, so projects, have received funds totaling $200,000. An additional nine awards totaling $225,000 were given through Megan's Walk Seed Operating Grants. The funds that you have raised and the funds that you will raise will help kids like us. We're fortunate to be at Sick Kids a world-class leader in the treatment of pediatric brain tumors. The research, the research that is done here helps kids across Canada and around the world. 
Megan's Walk is very fortunate to have both of you, Sean and Nir. Thank you for spreading the message of hope for kids right across the country.